I had one more card, and I haven't done a, a, a reading with, with an attachment for quite a while. Um, that's a bummer because generally um, people don't... <laughs> it's so funny. Um, tune in as much to the second um, attachment as they do to the first one, but um, I do want to give it to you because it's really powerful. It's just a short little message, but it's really a blessing to get it. Um, and I'm sorry that the wind blew it off the table and I didn't realize I'd lost it. So, the message is miracles. And looking at this picture, what does that look like to you? Magic and miracles abound in the forest to me. So what they're saying is the challenges that we've been facing, <laughs> the ones that we've been talking about, they have actually been crucial to our success. I love how the um, color of the rose quartz picks up on the card. I love the colors. Again, we've got the gold, right? The shielding from the divine masculine, the sun, and the royal purple, the highly spiritual color, and the green of the heart chakra, and then the pink of the heart chakra, the rose quartz. Love that. And then in the center, the white, the white light shining. Okay, so... Sometimes things basically get tipped upside down on their head, like which what I was talking about just now, so that a new perspective is able to be seen. Right? It got pretty hairy for me, and uh, it had to be in order for me to see it and understand what was going on. So they're saying that at this time, if something in your life has felt like completely out of control or upside down, um, it was it was it was tipped upside down on its head it, because you had to look at it in a different way. Things had to be seen. You had to experience that in order to... Sometimes we have to go through difficult things to experience difficult things in order to see things in a different light. Um, and what they're saying is as that difficult cycle ends, a new cycle begins, which is why we saw the, um, the, the vulture, which is talking about death, rebirth, and transformation, as well as the butterfly, which is the transformation. So one cycle ends, a new cycle begins. The dove just came up and he just sat right up there and I was going to turn around but he's kind of gone over the edge, you can't see him. He literally is just sitting there looking at me. So um, I like him being my messenger. Um, so with the new beginning, so as this difficult cycle ends, you've been through hell, as that ends and the new cycle begins, that's when the miracle occurs. So what they want you to understand um, is that you deserve to be and have everything that your soul desires right that's why the dragonfly said pay attention to your dreams your dreams are valid and sound you deserve to see them fulfilled so they're talking about there's miracles that happen every single day we just have to look for them for me it was a miracle to, to recognize that I was in adrenal failure that was a miracle that 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 I could save myself uh, I, something that was going wrong and I didn't even understand it um, the fact that I'm able to um, channel somebody from the, from spirit, that's a miracle. The fact that I'm able to um, lucid dream um, and see things ahead, that's a, it's a miracle. So I, I had to look at things differently because um, we could have had, um, I had a, I had a psychic woman come up to me a couple years ago and she said to me, um, she's very well known, I won't tell you who she is, um, but she said to me, you're going to hate it. And I said, what? And she said, your gift. And I said, I didn't, I mean, she knew what my gifts were. She's very clairvoyant. And she said, I can't drive a car. Um, I have things coming at me all the time. I can't walk into a room. And the smells overwhelm me because it takes me to different places. I t and, and basically she had the same issue. I know a lot of people have the same issue. But now I understand that she had those gifts. She also has the power. She also has the, to, to, to create a, her own miracle. She has the power to counteract and to balance her gifts. So that was a miracle for me. I got to the place where I was feeling like it was a curse, and it's not a curse, it's a blessing. It's absolutely a blessing. So don't so, so make a miracle out of your out of your curse, turn it into a blessing. You have the power to do that. Um, and sometimes what they're saying is all it takes is just a minute, and everything changes just like that. Things can change overnight. So your miracle may unfold. Today everything's going this way and all of a sudden tomorrow it's you wake up and everything is completely different. And that's what they're saying. It may just take a second for your miracle to occur. So hold on to that message. That's a positive message. I liked it. So I had to come back for that.
All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.